Hey, I am three plus key, your favorite social worker. Welcome back. Let's do a little three with key today, baby. Okay. So I had a family come in <laughs> and it was a, a parent and um, two youth. And so I say, you know, hello very serious, you know, my name is Lakita, and I'm, a, you know, a social worker here, and tell me why one of these kids said, well, I'm George Washington, and the other, the other youth, this is Thomas Jefferson, and I said, oh, well, I'm Benjamin Franklin. This youth has the nerve to say, no, <laughs> hey, you are Martin Luther King Jr. I said, no, baby, I'm Malcolm X. And we started the meeting. I love that. Y'all are coming to me on one of the worst days of your life and are still cracking jokes, <laughs> finding the humor in the situation. You met your match in me. I'm, I'm ready and down for a joke at any given moment. It eases the tension. And I think the larger message is, right, life happens. Um, there's a time to cry, there's a time to uh, reflect and, and be downcast and, um, you know, just be aware and acknowledge the, the severity of the situation, the seriousness, um, the profundity of, of, the, of the scenario that you, you find yourself in. However, crying really isn't going to get you to the next step. And another way to approach the situation is with humor. That's not for everybody, I know. Um, but if you can learn to embrace that type of resilience, um, you might find that that your your trials and tribulations may be uh, better manageable. You know. Um, I had a friend contact me recently who just discovered this and and she was saying, you know, one thing I've learned to do is put on a uh, a comedy video um or read a joke 